this is just a, a short exercise to illustrate how we draw charts in Excel, in particular how we draw charts with non-adjacent columns. So I'm going to first of all, gonna if I wanted to draw a chart which included the ISEC index and Allied Irish Bank with dates along the bottom, I would just highlight those cells and click Insert Chart. If, however, I want to draw a chart with, let's say, C&C Group, which is over here, I would highlight these in my first two. But as I move to the right, I, I discover that I highlight everything. So instead, I just put my finger on the control key, come up to here, keep with my finger on the control key, and hi highlight my next data item. I then say insert, line chart, and there it is. I'd rather it was on a sheet of its own, so right click, move data, new sheet. This chart isn't particularly informative because it has the scale is so much different. The units for the ISEC index are in the 4000, the unit for CNC group 2 point something. So what I would like to do then is I would like to right click on this red line which is the CNC group which you can see it shows no information. Select format data series and select a secondary axis. Press switch. So now you can see CNC group measured on the right hand side axis and the ISEC index measured on the left hand axis. Let's just tidy it up a little bit. So right click, select data and just select edit and put some titles on it. So I will choose for that and then for the second series edit series name CNC group. So it looks a little bit neater in a moment. I can also, if I go along the top and change to layout, insert a chart title above the chart. So I'll just edit that by clicking the box and I'll say ISEC 20 index um, C and C group. I can of course insert axis titles. So for the primary vertical axis title, so I can add it non or rotator title or vertical title. So I'll just do a vertical title. So that's the ISEC 20 index same and likewise axis titles secondary vertical axis title so we choose that we put C and C group so now we know which axis the feature is measured on an alternative way of doing this is if for example as the Financial Times would do would be produced in monochrome so just two colors how would you be able to differentiate between the red line and the blue line well, let's just start by Remembering that the blue line is the ISEC index, the reddish line is the CNC group. Let's just delete the legend. I could then insert a text box. So here I can insert a text box. I'm just using my mouse to drag it. And I could say ISEC 20 here. I could highlight it. I could increase the font on this if I wished. And then I'll insert another text box down here for C and C group. And again I might do increase the font here. And then I can insert some shapes. And we've got some arrows here. So I could move my arrow from C and C group to the red line. And again insert shapes and take another arrow from the ISEC 20 to that line. So now we can see which line is which. And so now the line the chart is pretty perfect. So that is how we draw charts in Excel, add labels, use the secondary axis, insert a text book, 